You're doing great. In this video, I'm going to explain joint cost allocation, the estimated net realizable value method. The scenario is the same which I have used both in my physical unit method and sales value at split of method. Now here, the joint cost, the product A, product B, and the byproduct C is there. As I have told you before also, if the byproduct C is inventoriable, in that case, we will deduct the value of the byproduct C from the joint cost. But if it is very immaterial and it is not inventoried, then this value, it will not be deducted from the joint cost. Now, in this particular example, we have not inventory the byproduct C. Here in this slide, I'm, tell, uh, I'm explaining how to allocate the cost using the estimated net realizable value method. So how do you find out the net realizable value? The formula for that is final selling price per unit. Please students make note of this. It is not the selling price at the split off point that you have to use. You have to use the selling price after the pro further processing cost. So final selling price per unit minus the further processing cost or the selling cost into number of units of the product will give you the net realizable value of the product. For product A here it is 26,000 and for product B here it is 51,000. Please observe carefully that the final prices have been taken, final selling price. 20 for product B and 17 for product A. So now we have got the estimated NRVs of both the products. Now it, with this ratio, we are going to allocate the joint cost. Now product A is equal to 26,000 divided by the total of these two. So it is 77,000 into 42,000. And 51,000 divided by 77,000 into 42,000. So you get the answers. And if you see the jo total joint cost that is being allocated to each of them together is 42,000. So this is how you calculate the estimated net realizable value method joint cost allocation. Now, in case you have any doubts, please do mail me if you have any questions which need to be clarified you can definitely mail to me at the address given on this slide and not only that any doubts you have please comment below i'll definitely get back to you with the explanation so see you in my next video till then take care and bye bye